let's try to derive some analogies between arithmetic and set theory now in arithmetic if we look at the addition operation we know that x plus y is equal to y plus x for any two numbers x and y so for the addition operation if we change the order of the operands so the operands are the numbers on which the operation of addition is being performed if we change the order of operands that is if we switch x and y we know that it doesn't change the result of the addition operation and the same applies to multiplication also x multiplied with y is the same as y multiplied with x so this property of an operation of yielding the same result even if the order of the operands is switched is called the commutative law and we have seen that in the context of set theory we have commutative laws for the operations of union and intersection because a union b is the same as b union a and a intersection b is the same as b intersection a so the operands here are the sets a and b the operands of the union operator and the intersection operator so if we switch the order of the operands it doesn't make any difference to the result of the operation whether it's union or intersection so both union and intersection satisfy the commutative law both these operations uh, satisfy the commutative law